When you think back on past Super Bowl commercials, you might remember mini Darth Vader. Or that time Betty White really needed to eat a Snickers bar. You're playing like Betty White out there. That's not what your girlfriend said. But there's a reason you probably remember the puppy in Clydesdales. At this point, Budweiser and the Super Bowl are practically synonymous. It's because Budweiser's brewing company, Anheuser-Busch, has been the exclusive alcohol advertiser for the big game for decades. But one wine company, Yellowtail, isn't taking no for an answer. Since it can't purchase national ad time, it bought local ad time in 70 TV markets instead. So the majority of Super Bowl watchers will see Yellowtail's wine commercial on February 5th. Since Anheuser-Busch got exclusive rights in 1989, it's been decades since we've seen a wine company advertise during the Super Bowl, like Paul Masson Vineyards did in 1980. And buying up local ad time wasn't cheap. Yellowtail's marketer told AdAge the total cost ended up being more expensive than buying a national Super Bowl ad. A 30-second time slot has an estimated price tag of about $5 million.